Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children is a novel with a great mixture of creepy and intrigue. The main character, Jake, has a grandfather who used to tell him stories about a children's home he used to live in with children with special powers. As Jake got older, he found these stories harder to believe, but right before his grandfather died, he told Jake to go find this home. Jake does some digging and eventually finds some clues on where to go. So he and his father travel to a practically desolate island in Wales. There, he finds the children's home, but it is completely destroyed with no one living there. He later finds out that everyone there had died in a World War II attack. But Jake later goes in to find the home where he sees a girl named Emma. He follows her into a mound of stones. Emma introduces Jake to Miss Peregrine, who tells Jake that when he entered the mound of stones, he also entered the loop, where every day is September 3rd, 1940. Jake meets lots of peculiar kids, some invisible, some who can bring the dead alive, um, some who can levitate, and some whose dreams come true, and more. As you follow Jake on his journey, this book plays with the ideas of supernatural beings in a fascinating way. This book is a fairly easy read and takes a lot of unexpected but interesting turns. It also has pictures of the peculiar children, which keeps you reading. I would highly recommend this book to anyone.